I'm not saying I don't like the striped shirts they get me for Father's Day, but come on. going on everybody I hope you guys have been having a fantastic week I'm so happy you're here today we're going over the ultimate Father's Day gift guide I'm gonna help you take your gifts to the next level with a few simple strategies and tips let's get into it okay so first let's talk about gift strategies I like to use three different strategies the first is very simple just ask him ask your dad hey dad what are some things that you want for Father's Day. What are your top three things that you would like for Father's Day? Uh, guys, we're simple. We don't really necessarily need to get surprised or, or this and that. If you just ask us, we'll tell you. Number two is upgrade. Find something that he uses on an everyday basis and that he likes and upgrade it. Upgrading something that he already has is a great way to make sure that he's gonna use what he gets. The last gift strategy is what I like to call the shotgun approach. I basically do or buy a whole bunch of little things throughout that day to make your dad feel special. But not all dads are built the same. We all kind of receive and interpret gifts differently. So how can we personalize those gifts to your dad? Okay, let's talk about that. First number one is to do something for him. Now, it could be something like taking his truck or car to go get detailed. It could be going to get his window, windows tinted. It could be getting up early, making him breakfast. Doing something for your dad is always a great present for him. Number two is spend some quality time with him. Maybe you can take a day out of work, find something that he likes to do, something that he enjoys to do, and go spend the day doing it with him. Some dads prefer time over gifts. Some dads like it when you talk to them and you reinforce something that maybe they don't hear very often, like try telling your dad something like this. Hey dad, you know, I've always really liked it when you did blank. Telling him the things that you enjoy, the things that you love about him is a great, great present to give your dad on Father's Day. A lot of dads love it when you buy them things. And I'm gonna give you five that I think your dad's gonna like. Maybe your dad's the kind of guy who likes to hug. Ladies, if you're out there, uh, maybe taking 20 minutes to rub your dad's shoulders would absolutely be a great gift idea. Okay, so we've talked about it enough. Let's get to five different gift ideas that you can get for your dad that I'm sure he's gonna enjoy. Okay, first and foremost is a watch. I think all guys should have three watches. Work watch, day watch, and the night watch. Find one of those three watches and upgrade it. Or buy him one if he doesn't already have one. Uh, they should be kind of tailored to his style um, or you know, rugged, whatever your dad's into, go that direction. Okay, next is upgrading his tools. Now, if he's anything like my grandfather, uh, he probably had some big bulky tool, right? You can get him something like this. This is a Dewalt Extreme 12 volt. It's small, it's compact. If you haven't seen my review, check out my channel, it's in there. Uh, you can upgrade his tools to something like this. It'd be a great, great present for him on Father's Day. Okay, next, is your dad a pistol guy? If he is, you can either buy him a pistol or you can buy him an accessory for that pistol. This right here is an Olight Mini. It's a great, great uh, small light for a small gun. Um, or if, if you don't want to do that, you can give him an extra mag. That also works. Buying him extra mags for his pistols is a great, great way to go. Next is a pocket knife. Now this right here is a Kershaw. And what I like to do with pocket knives is if you have access to an engraver, um, I like to engrave his name or their name on top of the knife and it kind of customizes it. If you can do it by hand, it's actually kind of better because it, it it's a little bit more personal. And that's one of the routes I like to go is a good pocket knife. And lastly is a pair of 511 APX pants. Um, if your dad doesn't wear the APX pants, they're not necessarily so much like, like clothing options, but they're almost kind of like gear. If your dad tries on a pair of 511 Apex, he's probably not gonna go back to wearing regular blue jeans again. Okay, so lastly I wanna say is if your dad worked and he provided for his family and he protected his family and he was there, then you were given a diamond from God. 
With all of its imperfections and all of its flaws, it's still beautiful and strong. And no matter what you give your dad, make sure you remind him, make sure you tell him, hey, I know things didn't always work out the way you wanted them to, but you were always here, you always looked out for me. And I'm so happy you're the man you are. So at the end of the day, that's what Father's Day is all about. Taking the time to remind your dad about how awesome he is and how much he means to you. And when you tell him that and you connect it with your gift, that's how you make any gift you give your dad special. Hey, so if this video helped you, make sure you smash the like button and subscribe. So I'll be coming out with new videos each and every week. Until then, stay extraordinary.